This is the Seahorse Hotel and is helping save endangered white seahorses in Australia. More than 350 endangered white seahorses were released in Sydney Harbour to reside at these innovative seahorse hotels. The eight new hotels are made from biodegradable metal, which will eventually break down and leave behind a reef to support the creatures who live there and the ecosystem as a whole. The hotels are installed a month before the seahorses are released so that marine growth like algae and sponges can accumulate, providing shelter for the seahorses and giving them a better chance of survival. According to scientists, the population in Sydney Harbour dropped by about half between 2008 and 2015. So the white seahorse or the Sydney seahorse is the second species of seahorse to be classified as endangered in the whole world, with the other species found in South Africa. It's the first species to be classified as endangered in Australia, and this is largely due to human impacts, including the effects that we have on their habitats. We've seen dramatic population losses, which means that we need to act now in order to help these guys persist into the future. We're aiming to continue the conservation for the species and it really promotes conservation of other aspects and other ecosystems as well. Seahorses are quite often considered a flagship species for conservation and it contributes to the conservation of their habitats and many other organisms. Scientists are hopeful for the potential growth of species after a 2020 seahorse release in Chowder Bay located on Sydney Harbour showed promising signs. One year after that attempt, 20% of the released population were still in the hotels and 10% were pregnant in the wild. The seahorses released as part of the project are tagged and will be monitored by scientists for the next 12 months.